first stop, Valley Village. Let's see what All we right. find. Quick sneak peek at what we've got. A couple of finds. A couple of finds here. Big find. The N64. The rest will show you at home. Hi Where everybody! Hello. Old game geezer here in the missus and Rambo. And Rambo. <laughs> Have a look. look. At the no, no, you won't look at the camera. Shy. Okay, we got another pickups video for you. We did a small hunt between three different shops, and uh, the first being Value Village. Um, we've got the most of it came from Value Village. Uh, pretty good picks up pickups today. So let's start. So, first was a Game Boy Color game, NBA Jam 99, and a Game Gear game of Majors Pro Baseball. Then a fairly sought-after game uh, for the Vita, Madden 13. We got uh, the best game we got of the bunch was for the Wii. A boy in his blob. PlayStation 2. Disney. Think fast. Uh, the last Burger King, King game we needed for all the Burger King games for Xbox. Big bumping. Let's do bumper cars. Everybody wants to do bumper cars. Now this game we thought we had... But when I opened it up, it was the wrong game in the box, so I picked up a good copy of it. It's complete. Didn't have it, so it was good. GameCube. For the GameCube. Rampage. And the game everybody wants <laughs> and has to put in their collection for the DS <laughs> is Tinkerbell. We'll pick up anything. Actually, we had a whole lot of everything there. So. Actually, Tinkerbell's cute. <laughs> But yeah, we did. We I don't think we missed too many systems as far as the newer systems were concerned. And for uh, and yeah, systems, some, some rare finds for this. For 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 GameStop, we got a GameCube. No uh, no cords, but I have all the cords for it, and it works fine. And the other one that I was happy to find was an N sixty four with the power connection, which is a hard one to find. I've got the other connections. It's got an expansion pack, just missing the door, but uh, I had a 30% off coupon for everything, so when I, they wanted 20 bucks for this, so when I ended up paying for it, it was only $14. A steal! So I think for 14 bucks, that was a pretty good buy. The GameCube was only uh, $7.99, and then with the discount, it was only like 5 bucks. Steal, steal, steal! So, those are pretty good pickups. Now we'll head on to the next place. Stop on our adventures and game hunting. It's going to be at the last game store. So the last game store pulled up a couple things. Some inbox Game Boy Advance games. Nothing special, but hey. I was trying to find a Atari 2600 game, but they didn't have it, so. It's the best one. Okay, on to our right. next shop, which is the last game stop in Halifax. Game store. Last, last game, game store. store. Okay, last game store. <laughs> we actually, I wanted to stop there because I was hoping to find, uh, they have quite a few Atari 2600 stuff. Unfortunately, everything they had, I already had or we already had. <laughs> I've sort of taken over that collection. <laughs> it was her collection when she was a kid, so I let her have it. <laughs> kind of. It still stays in my room. <laughs> but, uh. Couldn't find any of that, but Kevin found some, some stuff for him. So. We've got some Game Boy Advance games. Uh, not a lot of pickups, just three. But they were complete in box. This one being the worst box of the bunch, but it was uh, Scooby-Doo 2. Uh, these boxes are in really good shape. They're just not great games. We've got Backyard Sports. And again, really good shape, the box. And it's 
backyard skateboarding. So that was all our finds for the last game store. Okay. You got it. Uh, so not a lot there. They have a lot of games. They don't seem to get a lot of new stuff in. So it's pretty much the same stuff every time you go in. There's one or two items that are new maybe. Uh, but, uh, you know, they were cheap. They were only... They're only like four bucks each, so not so bad in the box. So on to the next stop. That should be our last destination for today. what we can find oh. here. Okay, so there wasn't a whole lot in there, but picked up a couple little things. Picked up a Game Boy player for the N64. And then several Game Boy Advance games that we'll show. Okay, and the last shop we stopped at uh, today was the Halifax Buy and Sell Pawn Shop. And uh, all we did was pick up some Game Boy Advance again. Uh, but th these guys were really cheap. Um, first one is Tom and Jerry's Magic Ring. Uh, that was the most expensive one at three bucks. These ones are all 95 cents each. We've got Kong on the floor. <laughs> Kong hit the floor. Kong, Kong down. <laughs> uh, I didn't realize, I forgot I had bought the boxed one, but I got another Scooby Doo 2. <laughs> Now he's got something to trade, so combine with something else. Uh, Hobbit. Shark Tail. And last but not least, check Shrek 2. Shrek 2. Uh, they're fillers for the collection, so, the, you know, they were cheap. And I like cheap, but I also like buying games. <laughs> So, let us know what you think. That's our uh, excursion out. And uh, tell us what, what you think of this new style of video that we're going to try with some uh, footage of going and adding all this stuff at the in-betweens. And just tell us what you think. So, leave us a comment, subscribe, like it. Yeah. We like to hear what you say. Yeah, you have do, to say. Do, it, do it down, down there. below. Down, down below. Down, 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 down below down somewhere. Here. Down, 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 down below down somewhere. Here. Do it. <laughs> Okay. We'll see you next time. Bye. Bye.